Hey guys, welcome to the channel. We're out here in the shop and I lined up some of the vintage saws that I have. Now, if you guys have been following and watching, I've been talking about these vintage saws saying I had a few. Uh, we recently fixed up an O30, steel O31 AV. It's from the 1970s. Got that baby going and cutting for a buddy of mine. And I've had these ones. Now, we've got a bunch of home lights, uh, home light Super XL, home light Professional 360. This is a home light XL12. We've got this old McCulloch, I believe it's a 110, 1-10, and then we got this uh, Home Light Super Easy Automatic, and this Corites Echo 302. Now, there are a couple other saws out in the tent, but I didn't want to bring them all in here at once. You guys might be thinking, well, geez, why are you showing me this? Why are we going over these? Because I have fun working on these, getting them going and getting them cutting again. Like I said, I've been talking about them in videos and on the live feed. And I said I wanted to give you guys the opportunity to help bring these saws back to life. And so I figured I'd share that with you right here in this video. Well, the big question might be, how can you help me bring these back to life? And obviously, the one big thing is liking this video. Liking the video, leaving a comment. When I'm fixing these saws and uh, making multiple videos per saw, leaving a thumbs up, leaving a, a good feedback, good comment really does help. It helps get that video out to other viewers. If you want to step it up and you really want to help me with these saws going forward, one, you can like those videos as they come out, watch them, obviously, leave me a comment, leave me feedback. But two, two, the really big opportunity that I'm going to give you guys to help me uh, bring these saws back to life is a financial opportunity. Now, I created a PayPal account, and at the moment, it is going to be used for vintage saw repairs, light restoration, whatever you want to call it. So what I want to be able to do is allow you guys or give you guys the opportunity to send in whatever you want to send through PayPal, and that money will be used toward fixing up these saws. What are we going to do with these saws when we're done? I'm not sure yet. Um, as of right now, they're just kind of going to be my own little collection, but maybe we'll figure something else out in the future for them. Who knows? We'll see. Now, if you look down in the description below and you click that drop box or that drop arrow, you go down in the description, you will see a spot where it says buy me a coffee or chainsaw parts via PayPal. So what you do there is you would log into your PayPal account. You'd have to set one up and uh, you would be able to PayPal me through the email address provided underneath there. It's Kyle Hall Woodworker at yahoo.com. So you would send PayPal payment through there whatever it is that you want to send toward fixing up a saw and you would uh make sure you comment you know on that or leave a note that says four chainsaw parts and we will use that money toward fixing up the next saws now i believe the next saws are going to be either this echo or that home light super easy if you're still watching why don't we just take a poll what do you guys want to see first which one should we fix up this home light Ha! My bad. Should we fix up this Echo 302 first? Or should we work on fixing up this Home Light Super Easy Automatic? Comment below. Let me know which one you guys choose. Now, like I said, guys, you don't have to support this channel um, financially. You don't have to support these saws, these videos financially. You can always support these videos in my channel by just giving a like, leaving a comment. That helps enormously with the YouTube channel helps it grow helps it get out there and helps us get more viewers and subscribers so I really do appreciate that stuff um honestly guys this is kind of it we're just taking a quick look at these saws I wanted to share with you guys want to let you guys know what the plan is these will be done over time I'm still going to be chainsaw carving and doing the snowblower videos and all that kind of stuff these are going to be the videos though in like the slower times when I don't have big orders or maybe I don't have the snowblower stuff going. We have other things going on. But honestly, this is fun for me. I really enjoy getting into these saws and getting them going. It's just, I don't know, it's it, it's relaxing. You know, I can sit out here with a cup of coffee and just tinker on a saw, pull things apart, put things together and uh, get them fresh, get them running. And uh, hopefully we'll get them cutting again, you know. But I enjoy it. Hopefully you guys will enjoy those videos as well. Um yeah, not really, guys, this is like a looking for your feedback kind of video. So give me a thumbs up. If you haven't already, hit subscribe, hit that bell, hit all. Make sure YouTuber notifications are on, guys. Leave me a comment, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks.